Good afternoon. Welcome to the 2016 Tour of Britain. Bigger and better than ever, and probably harder as well. It goes through Scotland, Wales, and England as well, concentrating on much of the western side of Great Britain. You can see the roads are nice and dry here as the uh, Quintet of Riders carry on th with their advantage over the main peloton. Well, there's a nice aerial shot of the peloton. The advantage at the moment for the break is 2.38. Still quite a long way to go, and we haven't got to the first King of the Mountains just yet. Let me just bring you up to speed once again. Both sprints at the moment have been won by Bovenhaus, and uh, it means that uh, Bovenhaus, both sprints, I should say, have been won by Bovenhaus and he at the moment is the current leader, and that's him right at the back. And there it is, that is a good spot there, Brian. Blood all down the knee of Ian Stannard, the big fella. And uh, it'll be interesting to uh, hear more about that. He's actually uh, been drafted into the team quite late. He wasn't on the original list, but Ian Stannard, of course, is worth almost 10 men when he gets to the front. <laughs> 13 kilometres to go then to the finish of stage one of the Tour of Britain in Castle Douglas. 18 seconds the advantage now and the big teams are starting to assemble at the front. There is urgency beginning to creep into their delivery and the big squads are lining up here. That was Czech Segafredo in the white on the one side of the peloton and then you could see the pace being applied by uh, the team of Mark Cavendish Dimension Data. Two uh, significant lead outs here, one on the right and one on the left beginning to form. Sky coming through as well. They've got several cards to play there. They're obviously looking after Viviani. Stanard looking back to see who's going to join him and profit from the power of the big man. Here it is, and they're in the finishing funnel now, and they're looking for the line, and it's Lotto Sudell leading this one out. Greipel sitting in third wheel at the moment. He's got to wait to time his effort, and you can see the direct front-on shot here, getting the lead out as the rest of the riders are starting to come through as well. There's Camel Ewan. Camel Ewan. Ewan is right in the mix as well. Caleb Ewan trying to come through, but still waiting to release himself. It's Greipel. Here goes Greipel now. Greipel on the right, and it's Caleb Ewan that's in the wheel of Greipel. Can Ewan take it off? Greipel, the line is getting closer now, he's looking for it, he's looking for it, here comes Greipel, Greipel takes it, first place on the line from Caleb Ewan, the Australian, so the big crowd waited anxiously and they were rewarded but Cab didn't get in the mix there. So here is the result, Greipel getting it from Caleb Ewan and uh, Sinkledam third, Ricci fourth, Nizola fifth and Ruffoni sixth. So the winner of stage one from Glasgow to Castle Douglas the German champion Andre Greipel riding on Lotto Sudel.